Thank you so much for coming back to my channel for your stimulus check and stimulus package update. Please subscribe to my channel. Please leave your thumbs up and please leave your comments. First of all, I want to say thank you so much for all the support that you give me on this channel, allowing me to do this. Thank you so much. Y'all, if you didn't see last night's uh, 7 p.m. video, please go back and watch it. It's uh, starting of the new contest, the $1,000 giveaway. And it's also the unboxing of the silver play button. Please don't miss that. Also, stay tuned until the end of this video. I got something very, very important to share with you. Uh, I'm going to have two contests going at the same time. And I want to share this with y'all. Okay. This is the start of a new week. So, will we get anything done this week with Congress? I will have to say, probably not, because Congress does not give a damn about you or me. They've proved it time and time again. Y'all, I gotta ask y'all something. Put it in the com comments down below if you have a good answer for it. Congress, I mean, the government closed down everything, thus making people lose their jobs, lose their businesses, lose their careers, lose their homes, not being able to put food on their table. They caused all of this by closing everything down. And there will be people that says, no, they didn't cause it because we had a pandemic. Yeah, we did have a pandemic. But you, if you remember, they said wearing mask works. Wearing mask would stop the spread of COVID. So if mask works, why did they close everything down? It just don't make sense to me. So yes, they caused all of this. And yet they don't want to help the American people. I believe the people that lost their jobs, lost their homes, lost everything they've got, I believe they need at least a $2,000 check every month until a year after this is over for compensation for their misdoings. Because if mask works, there was no reason to close everything down. Evictions. If you're facing eviction, well, we know Congress don't give a damn about you. I do, but they don't. I wish I could bail every one of you out, but I just can't. But please, remember them in the midterm elections and in the 2024 elections. Let them know just how much you don't care about them. For stimulus checks, will we get one? I still believe we will. I still believe 100% we will. The problem is, how much will it be and when will it be? It could be Christmas time. Hell, it could be next year. But does Congress care? No, they don't care as long as they can take vacation. A boost for Social Security, SSI, SSDI, and VA. And I'm going to wrap this together. I'm going to say a boost or a raise. Will they get it? I certainly hope so. I believe they will. But again, how much and when? Now, I will tell you, I don't think they will get both. I don't think they will get a raise and a boost. It would be one or the other. Nancy Pelosi's threat about arresting anyone in the chamber or in the hallways without wearing a mask might just come back to bite her in the ass. Everybody is mad at her on both sides of the party lines. I don't think she should have done that. They, they, they was calling for her removal last year, even her own party. What do you think is going to happen now after all of this? I don't think it's going to sit real good for her.
and they keep saying that both bills has to pass at the same time and I've been saying that that's a good thing because one can't pass without the other I mean but what is happening here nothing is happening it's it's holding progress up so I say why don't we go ahead and pass the bipartisan bill now get that out of the way and I'm going to talk more about that in just a minute so please don't go away what if we don't get a fourth stimulus check what if we don't get reoccurring checks what if we don't get a raise for SSI SSDI Social Security and VA and when I say a raise for them I'm not talking about the COLA raise that they get every year. I'm talking about a real raise, something that they can see in their pocketbooks. And what if we don't get Medicare reform? Well, if we don't get these things, the midterms are coming up and they will be out of a job. Y'all, they're not crazy. They may act crazy, they may look crazy, but they know what the deal is. They're going to make us wait as long as they can. But I believe all of these things we will get. And I'm not and I'm not talking about we need to get one of these things, one or two of these things. We need to get them all because if we don't get all of these things, they need to go. They need to be voted out of office. Because if these things don't happen, these things would be in the Reconciliation Act bill. The Democrats has full control of the House, the Senate, and the White House. And this is going to be a reconciliation bill. That means they can just cram everything in there they want and everything that the American public needs. But I guarantee you, they won't do that. They will put in one or two items just to appease us. Well we're not going to be appeased with one or two items. We need them all. Y'all, we have to remember these people in the midterms and in the 2024 elections. Okay, now back to passing the bipartisan bill. I think it would be a good thing to go ahead and pass this bipartisan bill because right now, not passing it is just holding everything up. And on the reconciliation bill, that's where we're going to get all the help if we get help. That's where it would be. We, we can't get help in the bipartisan bill. That's the infrastructure. So if we're going to get a stimulus check or anything like that, it would be in the Reconciliation Act. Therefore, Democrats can pass a Reconciliation Act just like that without any help from the Senate. So... Go ahead and pass it. Get it out of the way. Because holding it is not doing us any good. And then they can go ahead and pass the reconciliation bill. Because they don't need the other side on that. So why are we waiting? Okay, y'all. I got something I want to tell y'all about. You know I've started the uh, new contest, a $1,000 giveaway. Uh, it's in last night's video, 7 p.m. Please go back and watch that so you can hear what that's all about. But I'm also wanting to start another contest where you could win money every day on this channel. I'm going to explain it. But first, before I explain this, I know I'm going to get some haters where there are mean comments. That's fine. Haters, bring it on, please. I'm begging you to bring on your hate because every time you leave me a comment you give me a view plus engagement you're helping me thank you so much haters okay now on to this when I first started making these stimulus videos it was at the beginning of the pandemic there was only like three of us making videos then uh, three or four of us that was me that was uh, meet Kevin Clearview tax and Logan Alex I believe that was about all it was here but since then this this platform has been flooded with stimulus, and most of it, I'm sorry to say, is garbage. Let's talk through this. Here's the deal. Okay. I want to get 
well, when I first started, I was getting numbers like 300,000 views per video. I got a couple of them, 500,000 views per video. You can go back and check my first videos uh, and see that. But I would like to get numbers back into that range. Now, 500,000, I know that's pushing my luck. But I would like to get at least 100,000 views per video. And the way we can do this is for this complete full month. And we could extend it further. Let's just see how it goes. For every video that gets 100,000 views, someone in that video will get $100 every day seven days a week somebody's got a chance to get a hundred dollars i will randomly pick it i will contact that person now we could get crazy here and say if it gets two hundred thousand views two people will get a hundred dollars but i'm not gonna push my luck but a hundred thousand views i know we can achieve that but it may entail you doing something extraordinary to get get us there it may entail you watching the videos from first to finished a couple times to get those numbers up and in in the back end in the studio part of of this channel it will tell me how long people's watched i don't want you just to click on the video just to get that click and then click off that will hurt the channel I want you to actually watch the video you may have to watch it a couple of times to help get those numbers up but the more the numbers get up if you if you watch it say four times you got four chances of winning so this is going to be every day on the 6 a.m. well I'm not even gonna say for the 6 a.m. video for any video any video that reaches a hundred thousand views somebody in that video is going to get a hundred dollars now again i know i'm gonna get hate for this bring it on every time you give me hate that's a view and engagement thank you y'all leave me a comment below what you think about all this stuff we're going through right now what do you think congress is going to end up doing this week i'm guessing about the same as they've always done nothing but I'd like to hear from you too. Keep your faith in Jesus Christ. He's going to get us through all this stuff. I don't think it's going to be much longer. Say a prayer for our world. Say a prayer for our country. Say a prayer for our leaders. Say a prayer for everyone hurting through COVID, financial hardship, or any other affliction. Keep your faith in Jesus Christ. He will get us through this. Until next time, I love you all. Ciao.